Hi, welcome. On today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you a new virtual machine, a brand new virtual machine with Android 8 or uh, on it with Ruthie really Asset installed to work in profoundly, a lightweight Android container which is going to be working on any Android device or any Android version. It's going to be with Android 8. So the link will be available in the description of this video. What you need to do is just download from there. Install on your Android device. It does not have a problem. It does not have a virus. It's super light. You need to be working on your Android device with us Prabo. So download and I'm going to be uh, guiding you how to install step by step. So let's get started. So first of all, before you install the application on your Android device, before you uh, install the virtual machine on your Android device, first of all, you need to make some changes on your Android device or you will not have uh, the Android device. I mean, the application will not be working on your Android device without, without this step. You have to add license setting on your phone to have the application working on your phone. So what you want to do, just go to setting of your Android device. You want to scroll down to the last option about phone or about device just click on it software information and then you want to click on building number so building number if you don't see the building number there in your enter in your in your setting of your android device what you want to do is just click it by clicking the setting icon the cheesy icon in the corner then you will be able to choose what you want just type there a building number so once you did that open the developer option i mean uh, on building number, you want to click it around seven time to activate the developer option. Okay, so once you did that, it's going to say that you are now a developer. Once you are now a developer, you want to uh, find the developer option by clicking in the corner. If you don't see here on the setting, you want to click there and choose it for developer option. So um, open the developer option. On the developer option, you want to scroll down. And then you'll find this option which is saying window animation skills, transition animation, and animated duration. So from here, you want to do you want to reduce the window animation skill of your Android device. So to do that, just click on the window animation skill. Your Android device is gonna be set as animation skill 1x. You want to mark your animation skill 0.5x. So by doing that, you will be reducing the window animation skill. If you enter the device, so what you wanna do? You wanna do the same process on this true other option transition animation and animation duration, which is the last one. So once you did that, what do you wanna do now? You wanna download the application and install on your Android device. Um, let me install the app. It's going to be just like this. As I said, it does not have a virus. It's gonna be working on your Android device. It's a light virtual machine with Android with Android 8, so don't worry. Just install on your Android device. Alright, once you did that, once you have the application installed, on your phone what you want to do is just download i mean you just uh, click on open through open the application by doing that the app will start to initializing what you need to do now from now you want to be patient and wait a little bit this might take five minutes three minutes two minutes just depends on your device just to be patient As you can see, by doing that, the application will start up. It's going to be just like this. It's super light application with Android 8 with root uh, You will have this screen. Just swap up and now you will have a uh, this screen. So now what we're going to do before any day, we need to make some changes on this on this emulator. To, so to avoid the fails, to avoid the lags, we need to make some changes on this emulator. So you wanna click on the city icon. First of all, we're going to change this language, the Chinese language. So clicking on the last option. You want to click on the first one. 
we're gonna click it as well the first option from this screen you wanna click it on this icon the plus icon alright by doing that you will have all the language which are available on this emulator just select the one that you want to apply We want to track this to the first place by that the application when you start it will change the language automatically so the second thing we want to do here we want to change uh, we need to activate the, the developer option we need to disable the window animation of this of this virtual machine all right so to do that you want to click as well the last option system you want to click it on uh, about emulated device which is the last option Build the number and build the number you want to click on it around seven time to activate the developer option just like you did on the start so by that you will have a developer option unlock it you want to open that now we need to disable completely the window animation skill of this system this setting that you are applying here on this on this emulator will be only applied on this emulator this will not this will not be applied on your main intro system so don't worry so what you want to just disable the animation completely all right by that uh, you will have the application without problem working on your android device with the assets as i just said as you can see super user is installed to working perfectly uh, without problem without lag so if you want to install some application here if you want to install some file you want to move some file what you want to do you want to click this icon just to install your apps your game just click it on, the, on, on that icon you want to click it on the first option which is saying import apps okay by that okay by that you will have all the applications which are installed on your android device what you want to do just select the application that you want to install and uh, just click it on import apps by that the application will be installing your application will be installing your game as you can see i have just installed root shaker on this on this emulator as you can see android uh, android 8 rooted successful what you want to do just enjoy do what you want to do uh, android 8 installed working perfectly uh, let me okay so the link will be available in the description of this video what you want to do just for the load from there install on your android device the application does not have a virus does not have a problem this will be working on any android device any android version you don't need to worry about it. so if you want to install play store or something you want to click it in this this uh, the this icon let's try to install play store google play store let me type google play store st Clicking on it, I'm going to try to install and see what is going to happen. Okay, as you can see, Google Play Store installed successful, working perfectly. What do you want to do? Just the, uh, put your account and start to do what you want to do. Start the, downloading your games, downloading your apps. Okay, so that was the video stuff from here. Hope this video help you out. If this video help you out, please leave a like and subscribe if you are new. I leave the notification to get notified about new video. And I hope to see you on my next video. Peace.